I am doing a real mom ride along with Liz. Okay. Do you want to tell them what you're driving? I am driving the VW Atlas R Line. Ooh, R Line. What does R Line mean? R Line, I guess it's an exterior feature that just spices it up a little bit more. It has to do with like racing. Well, I love racing. I love racers. <laughs> and I'm going to love the R Line. What do you think? I love it. So far, I mean, I can't tell you I don't like your car. That would be rude. You could. You could. No, I could. I would. I would tell you that. I love the Pano roof, first off. I'm obsessed with those lately. Same. It's comfortable. It is. We've been going for a few minutes. We were catching up before we started mm -hmm. the video. I'm digging it. We're going to stop up here at our favorite little coffee shop and show you the outside and stuff. But before you pick this, what were you choosing between? So it's kind of funny. I was an influencer sort of steered me toward this vehicle subscription program called DriveFlow. Have you heard of DriveFlow? I'm going to say yes, but <laughs> basically what they do is it's a subscription service where there's several tiers and you can exchange your vehicle whenever you need to. So you can, if you need a truck, then they'll drive a truck to you. And then the next week you need a car for date night and they'll drive you that. And um, so that's awesome. in the second to top tier were like BMWs, Volvos, Audis, and a VW Atlas. And so, and the influencer actually said that her favorite of that class was the VW Atlas. And so that's how I originally got attracted. Oh, so you never actually did the drive flow? I never did. Can you say the V word again? Volvo. <laughs> okay, what's your favorite things that you love about this car? I'm not really a car person. Really, all I need is a heated seat. And this is Apple CarPlay. Mm -hmm. What's the Volkswagen button do? never pushed it. You're really not a car person. I'm not. Fabulous. So you literally just get in and drive to school, drop yeah. your daughter off, mm -hmm. drive to get your coffee, go to my office. Yeah. But you're riding in style in the R line. I do. I love this car. Let's go check it out. Okay. We're checking out the R line. Volkswagen Atlas. I really like it, Liz. You see our fire truck in the back. What do you like about it? I kind of like the minimalist. Sometimes when things are too nice, it stresses me out. Yes. Because I don't have time to read a manual. All right, the two things I always check out in a mom missile. Are there sunshades? Yes, there are. And user friendly. Where are the vents to point in your child in the car seat? Okay. Right here. I don't mind that. You have USB. USB. Got everything. Super user friendly. Yeah, it really is. Good job, Volkswagen. Okay, hey, you're in the back of your own car. I'm in the back. Have you sat there before? I have, yes. Okay. It looks like you have plenty of leg room. I do. Do you have long legs? I'm 5'4". Okay, but you look tall to me. You have a big personality. And big four-inch platforms. I like the shoes. Okay, and this is where Lark sits. How old is your daughter? She's four. Pre-K. Pre-K. And she's nice and cozy back here. Okay, have you ever gotten in the third row? I've never gotten in the third Let's row. Let's do it. Do this thing. I love to be with you on your first time. That's pretty simple. Are. Let me check out your leg room. Not bad. Not you bad. like it back there? I do. Pretty cozy. Okay, my husband's six four. Could he sit there? Probably not. Okay. Unless he. Uh, no. I mean, honest to God, he can't, he can't sit many places comfortably. True. So that wasn't a fair question. But we usually keep this down for more cargo space. But it's an option. Yeah. 
You could fit a lot of suitcases back there with that seat down. True. And all your DIY projects. I'm not a big DIYer. Are you? No, but no. you're a traveler, so suitcases it is. That's right. Okay, let's do a little real mom ride along trivia. Okay. All right, what was your first car? A four door Ford Focus. Okay, cute. <laughs> All right, what color was it? Black. I keep it simple with cars. Like, this is the fourth car I've ever owned, and I'm 44 years old. So you're basically going to drive the wheels off of this I thing. I drive them into the ground, yes. I've had a Ford Focus. I've had a used convertible Saab. I have a Jeep Wrangler and the VW Atlas. Interesting. I'm the polar opposite of you because I like to get a different car every three to four years. Okay. As soon as, I don't even want to change the tires. Basically, if it needs new tires, I'm getting another new car. Okay. What's your sign? Virgo. Oh, that's why. I'm an earth sign. I'm Aquarius. I'm an air sign. So I'm a free spirit, fly by the seat of my pants, cannot balance a checkbook. Okay. I bet yours is down to the penny. Yes. <laughs> I am a spender though. Like I am a spender, but it's not on cars. Like okay. cars aren't my jam. I'd rather decorate my home or have, you know, like style in a different way complete opposite of me. <laughs> I have zero style. It's really unfortunate. You do have style. It's, it's pretty basic. Okay, well, this is so interesting. So you are very much a utilitarian vehicle owner. So you've picked VW. You got the nice trim level, but you don't really care about the options. And I feel like this is a good car for you because it's not so much loaded into the dash and into the system that you can't figure it out and don't really give a crap exactly but it has all the basic comforts that you need to be a cutting edge milf right <laughs> what else can we say about you what else do you need that's it <laughs>